Grand Rising. Grand Rising. Today is my 87th post for the 254 day challenge. The scripture is Mark 9:35. It speaks about life here on earth and how you value it for yourself or for our Lord and Savior. It's basically saying you work to try to hold on to your life and what you have for you you will lose it but if you give up that life and work in terms of pleasing the Lord our Father dedicating your life and your works to our almighty Father then life happily ever after won't say happily ever after because there's a balance things won't always seem rosy for depending on the choices and things that we make and how we hinder ourselves or lessons that we may not have learned where the Lord may in turn harden or soften someone's heart and opening and closing doors to push you into the destiny in which he's called you to be. Today is Friday. Many say happy Friday as they don't have to work on Saturday and Sunday, but I do. <laughs> So, I'm just going to say happy Friday. Thanks for stopping by my page. If you haven't subscribed, please hit the subscribe button. Let the bell turn black if you would like to know each time I upload. I appreciate you. Also, if you can like or dislike, tell me why or why not appreciate you for that as well I'm gonna run hopefully I always say this I can get another one in for the day I'm I'm not gonna say what I am gonna do but I'm gonna try again thanks for stopping by it's post 87 for the 254 day challenge have a great one. By the way, remember, praise and worship, praise and worship, will the spirit in, spirit and truth. Get your praise and worship on, dance and shout for the Lord. Today's artist. I'm not going to say songs. I'm going to let you go pick on your own. But we were with Yolanda Adams. William McDowell. And Ty Tribbett. I also went back and listened to tracks 4, 8, and 10. T.D. Jake's Threshing Floor. Why? a lot of affirmations in there. Powerful affirmations. My mind frame is as a man thinks so is he. I was listening to a motivational video the other day 
I know maybe it was Jim Rohn who talked about mindset. We are who we are because of our mindset. If you believe you're poor, you're poor. If you believe you're rich, you're rich. But you'll have whatever your mind desires consciously and unconsciously. If you speak of negative, you bring on negative. If you speak and think on positive, you bring in positive. Mindset. Is it poverty or is it of abundance? The secret, that's what I was listening to. The secret of success. Secret, the secret, it's all in your thoughts. Energy, energy. They say energy, it's real. Remember when we were a kid, they say, you can be anything your mind says you can be. That's real. Shouts out to the Detroit Dog House. They had an awesome event back on August the 20th. Unfortunately, I couldn't make it due to corporate clock, but the city is raving. Shouts out, Alicia and Detroit Dog House. Once again... I survived it.